All right, what is up, guys? Nate Four here, and welcome back to Uncharted Three: Jack's Deception. I ain't gonna lie, the first time I recorded this, I said this was Marvel's Avengers, and this is not that. So yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna just cut that part out. Come on, Charlie. What's the holdup? Yeah, yeah. Oh, someone's claustrophobic. It'll all be over soon. It'll all be over soon. It'll all be over soon. That's it. That's it. That's all. It'll be okay. Oh, that wasn't too bad. What the hell is wrong with you? Nothing. I'm fine. All right. This one should be kind of simple and clean. Wait. We can get around this way. Nothing too over the top or anything like that. Just kind of a chill episode. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Here you go. Make me look bad, huh? Is that what we're doing now? Wall's too high. Yeah. All right, oh, we're gonna have to move this, aren't we? I got it. Put your back into it, mate. We haven't got all bloody. Yeah, some help night. would be nice. Yeah. Thanks for the help. <laughs> With that, Come man, on, it's okay. Lazy asses. We're obviously gonna carry the uh, right. the group. Looks like the coast is clear. That was a cool little transition, I guess. You should be more careful with your head, you know it. <gasps> Chloe! Evening, lads. She's right, back. back. <sighs> Looks like hell spit you two back out. Yeah, it was a thing of beauty, Chloe. I went off without a hitch. You're unusually quiet. What's up your bum? Oh, well, Charlie seemed to enjoy himself a little bit too much for there my taste. Go. <laughs> my ears are still ringing. Oh, for God's sake. Helps if you have something Unacceptable. <laughs> oh, it looks like I missed out on some fun. Yeah, you did, actually. It was very, very uh, cathartic. Yeah, that's funny. Do you have any trouble? Easy peasy. And you're sure they didn't see you trailing them? Not a chance. So, which door scary pop inside in behind? <laughs> behind that one there. The green one. They drove in ages ago and it's been dark ever since. You think they're still in there? Well, I haven't taken my eyes off it. And no one's gone in or out. Yeah. Okay, and also guys, I might it really necessary? switch I mean, up the face cam, I'm not sure yet. Don't underestimate like, so it shows like more it, of my body, I'm not sure if I should or not. Up. Just like that. Yeah. Just Fair something enough. I'm thinking about. Any trouble, you shoot first and ask questions <clears throat> later, alright? Alright. Man, I was sorely tempted to just pick up that briefcase back there and walk. Yeah, I guess you get on the other side of the car. <laughs> But I like Trust this me, shot though. Like it's just the four of us just yeah, walking well, down the street. Kind of cool. Ew. Didn't I tell you? My oh, voice just my voice just cracked, Look, but we're I not gonna talk right about that. About but yeah, man, Chloe is back. She was in the second game, and now she's in this one. And she also gets a game dedicated to herself. You know, Uncharted: The Lost Legacy. You think they're still in there? That's after Uncharted 4, but we're not gonna just we'll talk about that when we get there. Out. We can't afford to waste time standing. <clears throat> okay, I'll find looks a way like in we're gonna have to out. climb this conveniently placed pipe. Because you know, no one else is gonna do it. You know. <laughs> oh God. Because you know, we're the most agile. We're the most fit for the job. Sorry about that. It'd be a shame if we slipped in these, you know, dress uh, shoes. Brothers, freaking people screaming outside. <laughs> I don't know if the mic is gonna pick it up or not, but hey, I guess. Whoa! <laughs> All this climbing without any gear, any gloves, no harness or anything, man. He's got balls of steel. Yes, he does. All right. All right, jump. Okay, okay. Where did it go? <clears throat> um. Can I go over? Oh, wow, man! It's already been past four minutes in the video, and you still haven't hit the like button. What's up with that, man? You should definitely do it. <clears throat> Where the hell did they go? This doesn't make any sense. All right. Give me a hand with this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got it. Surely there was an easier car? way we could have got around. Because I don't see a car. I don't understand. <laughs> Damn it. Are you sure this is the right one? Yes, the green door, I'm sure. Nate, we are losing time here. That damn briefcase is looking better and better. 
All right, come on. They didn't just vanish into thin air, right? Okay. There's got to be an explanation. Just spread out, look around. I believe I remember this part, so it shouldn't take that long. Here. Especially since it's still at like the beginning of the game, so none of the puzzles should necessarily be difficult. Tire tracks. So, the rain. like if you, like you can see it in like, like the, the uh, right hand corner. Like there's like these little uh, planks, well, not planks, but you know. Yeah, and it's convenient because there's four of us right now, <laughs> so you know we don't have to put any. Like heavy objects here, we can just stand on them. <clears throat> Some kind of mechanism. Yeah, maybe. Four tires, four points four of contact. Four tires, four Sully. points of contact. Stand right there. You two, right there and there. See, man. Where would they be without Nate? All right, everybody, on three. Nowhere, that's where. One, two, three. And. Well, this has got to be um, it. Shouldn't there be something on a wall? Oh, yeah. Wait, it's the light. The light, okay. Because the headlights, Sorry, okay. Aim your beam at the wall. Like headlights. <laughs> You're so smart. Well, I have a goddamn cadaver. Nate, just who are we dealing with here? Well, there's only one way to find out. Yeah, man, we'll drag the car. We head back to the van. We'll try and stay in radio contact. I'll let you know when we get through to the other side, all right? <laughs> Wherever the hell that is. Just be ready for anything. It might be a quick exit. No doubt. She's the best driver oh, in the business, you know. So I've heard. I would have rather Chloe be with us, but I feel a lot safer when it's like four of us together. <laughs> well, I think we agree this is more than a little weird. Drives their car underground. Oh, well, let me think. Someone who doesn't want to be followed, you know, it's just a guess. But I do have to hurry Smart up ass. and get this video out. Looks like they bored straight into the old service tunnels. <sighs> so I don't know what I'm gonna do. Hey, um, over here. It's not for long. Okay, okay. Look, um, there's an episode in the first Uncharted game that I did and I missed the lock <laughs> um, you gotta look for it um, I tried to shoot the lock and I missed and it was like literally just standing still I was so embarrassed that was cool because I actually get to um, control this part like they're not moving on their own I get to control it <laughs> alright back there yeah yeah you know just yeah, he's definitely claustrophobic. Okay. Yeah, just keep moving. Makes sense though, a lot of people are. Oh, thank God for that. Da, 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 da. Is there no auto viewing that? Oops. I see alright, alright, alright. Right. Um, they're not tough. We can get them. Nice one, mate. Alright, cool. Thanks. <gasps> um you finished dang did y'all see how quick he moved <laughs> quick um, all right but we're just gonna get him <laughs> no, no, keep the okay yeah Ooh, something shiny okay what is this a ring has to be but yeah, you can definitely see that they had fun with the camera work and the gameplay this time around. Like they definitely like outdid themselves with themselves. Ooh. That is a long way down. Hey, just beautiful cinematography and the gameplay. They got more animations this time around, so it's not all repetitive Careful, over and summary. over again. So I'm I'm happy with that. I think they did a good job. What the <laughs> The game just like froze right there. I don't know why. Oh my god, these rats are. He didn't see me, did he? Nope, 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 nope. What was that? Okay, now he did. <laughs> Bro, what? Are you. Bro. 
This man literally slid across the floor. And a ladder. <laughs> Looks like it's jammed though. Let me see if I can loosen it. I didn't know Nathan Drake could kick that hard. Who knows? Maybe he just hasn't skipped leg day. You know, he climbs a lot, so you know maybe his upper and lower yeah, body strength are really that strong. Bro, climb. <laughs> Like there's some sort of gate up there. Okay, there's a lot of climbing. Jeez. Sullivan should not be climbing at this age. Okay, okay, so. Where am I going with this? Uh. Oh, okay, I see what I gotta do. So I gotta go down. Okay. This reminds me of like a Mario level. Like when you gotta fight like on Bowser's um, castle and everything. If you know, if you play at them, then you know. What? Oh, I gotta wait. Okay. <laughs> I was confused. I was like, what? All right, Pull. ready? Pull. Whew, okay. Okay, Charlie. Come on. Man, this stuff is scary, man. <gasps> no! Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, I was about to say. That was almost really bad. Yeah, like, see, you can tell they were having fun with the camera angles and everything. Not mad at it, I really appreciate it. Um, okay, looks like that's where we're supposed to go, so I'm just gonna see if there's anything down here first. It's a dead end. Nope. Get out the way, Sully. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna get all the treasure this time right around. Here. Just if I can see it, I'm not gonna like try to get every single last thing. I'll still get some Charlie, though, the if I can. With here? I don't know, mate, but whoever they are, they are seriously weird. Oh, that's the end? Um, I don't know. Yeah, we'll keep playing, sure. Um, because that episode was kind of just dull. I don't know. I guess, yeah. <laughs> Maybe we can get through. Besides, these two are like pretty much together, anyways. That's why um, I did for the last episode too, because like they were both like relatively the same thing. So might as well just put them together instead of just making separate videos. Besides, I'm trying to get this game done as soon as possible. So why not? One of us should climb up there and see if they can dislodge it. Good idea. Guess who? <laughs> <laughs> uh, of course it's us. Of course. You know, we're the youngest, the most agile, you know, the most fit for the job. It's not that they can't do it, it's just that, you know, it makes more sense for Nate to do it, you know. I'm pretty sure it'd be a lot easier if you didn't have a freaking suit on in these dress shoes. <laughs> Alright. How do I get down? Shout out to Sully, man. At this old age, he's still doing all this stuff. And I guess we're staying up. Same thing with Charlie, man. He looks like he's like late 30s, early 40s. You know, so. These guys should be like retired from this life. <laughs> but. Who knows? Nate still has some years in him. I thought I died. Good eye. There's more in car. Away. All right. From here on, no more guns. No ah. guns. We need our guns. Bro, I would not, like, look at the freaking, um, things these things are being held by. 
like these things like very rusty and just not able to support you know a certain amount of weight <laughs> hands up oh, I don't know. we must have taken a wrong turn somewhere yeah is this king's cross okay don't i gotta move. take him out hey hey you got us all wrong man we're from, from cleveland <laughs> he said we're from cleveland <laughs> They keep showing me the freaking, um, what's this called? It's like the instructions and everything. I know how to play the game. The hell kind of place is like they did add some new stuff, so I guess. Some sort of train station or something. Is there anything over here? Anything at all? Things can't get any weirder. Okay, let me stop because I did see I'm not gonna get all the treasure, so. Yeah, let me stop looking all the time. <laughs> it's kind of just a habit at this point, but um, they must have gone through here. Yeah, I'm not gonna try to get every single last thing. Oh, this stonework looks like Tudor. Can I century. run? Hello. Um, I guess not. See, Chloe got the easy job. All she had to do was sit in the car and a little stakeout. Up this way. But, no, nope, we gotta do all the heavy lifting. We gotta do all the difficult stuff. Hey, over here. And no, it's not because she's a female. Especially Chloe. She's definitely capable of doing all the things that they're doing, as we've seen in the no, last no, game. No, no, seriously. If you haven't go, if you people. haven't checked those, out, hey, go check them I'm out. Not interested in your very exciting stuff. He was a loose cannon, and you should have known. Yes, it is regrettable, but not regrettable. Sloppy. Your poor judgment could have cost us everything. Four hundred years of searching. Finally, Drake's secret will be revealed. She's gonna find out it's a fake. What is this? I don't understand. It's a forgery. What? That's not possible. I verified it myself. This isn't the ring. Really? I held it in my Honestly, I, saw him put it I was never a big neck. fan of them as the um, villains of the game. <clears throat> We've been duped. Oh, yeah. She saw what we did to her when we were... Uh, kid, uh -huh. no. You men stand guard. We pulled that trick alert. on her last time. We may have been followed. <laughs> you come with us. Find them and bring me. But yeah, like room. I was saying, I never really I dug them as a villain. Um, that's probably the only thing the Uncharted series kind of struggled in was the villain department. Like the guy from the first game, they weren't really that impactful. Lazarvich from second game. He's probably my favorite because he was actually intimidating. He actually seemed like a real threat. Them, they don't like. It seems like a bit of a <laughs> a bit of a step back, in my opinion. Like we went from an angry like Russian guy to just these British people. Like, eh, I guess. The fourth game, the villain was pretty solid. Um, but yeah, I don't know. The Uncharted villains have always seemed either forgettable or just not that intimidating. Like the guy from the fourth game, the one that we're looking at next, he's solid just because the um Look at the story stuff. behind him, I guess. He's not like intimidating like Lazarevich was though. Ugh. Nate, focus. We haven't got much time here. Yeah. What are you? Uh, my God, do you know what this is? It's a book, mate. There's a lot of them in here. It's a library. It's not just any book, wise ass. <laughs> Belong to T. E. Lawrence. <laughs> you know, Lawrence of Arabia. Yes, yes, yes. I know who he is. Uh. This was mailed from Dorset on the day of his motorcycle accident, May thirteenth, nineteen thirty-five. They must have killed him once they got their hands on it. They? Yeah, they. 
they, them, whoever these people are. Oh, what a lot of rubbish. It was an accident. Witnesses saw a black car run him off the road. Guys. Oh, oh, oh so it was like a big cover-up. Maybe. Nate. What? That thing that you have been waiting 20 years for? 20 years? <laughs> right. <laughs> Do it. Do it, Nate. Do it for us. Here we go. L. And in case you're wondering, this is the actual ring from the game. This isn't just like a regular ring. It has all the same markings and everything as the one in the series. So, yeah. Huh. What is it? Ah, uh, it's... Long Hidden. What? Oh, God. Shh. No shit, Long Hidden. Are you kidding me? No offense, mate, but your ancestor was a right asshole. Just shut up. It's an anagram. Golden Hind. The Golden Hind. Drake ship. Yes. It's a clue. It's gotta be something hidden in this room. Oh man, we got right, ourselves out. a little. See what you can find. A little search party. But since I played this game so many times. I know exactly Golden where Hyde. it is because I remember I used to struggle like just looking for it so it should be up on one of these pillars it's gotta be here um it's definitely right in front of us but where oh there it is there it is I see it what is a chance so you know so you don't spend like 30 minutes looking for it it's right just right above you no no it's gotta be here See that quick, simple, and easy? That took me like less than 30 seconds to find. Oh shit, it's oh a god. trap! Oh god, oh god, They're oh god. here, take cover! This gun is not the strongest. Dude, you know how bad that would have been if it just crushed his. <laughs> uh, it crushed his area. Because that's real gold, man. Gold is really heavy. To Arabia. I like how we're just reading this in the middle of the shot at Got the journal in the cipher disc. Got it. Go. Oh man, okay. I think I can take him hand to hand. Yeah. We're running out of ammo. Where's weapons? Oh, that was clean. Okay. Key montage. Alright, that is the end of the montage, man. We had to We had to put the hurt on them boys because we we're Are you serious? Because we we're built different. Ooh, a shotgun. But yeah, man, not the longest montage ever, but it was pretty entertaining. I hope if you made it this far into the video. But the job is not done yet. We still have a ways to go. And I don't know why, but the sensitivity in this game is kind of, um, it seems different. Like, see? Like, I don't know why. Maybe I'm too far away, or the sensitivity is too high. Like, it seems a bit different from the first games. It's gonna be someone who's just like, no man, you're just trash. No, bro, I swear, but the sensitivity is like, really wank. Is one good word jank? Or just say it bad? <laughs> I'm pretty sure we're traumatized by trains, so we should probably get out of here. If you, if you watched um, the Uncharted 2 walkthrough that I did, 
you'll understand what I'm talking about. <sighs> I was about to say that was a headshot. He better go down. Where did you come from? Gee, thanks for the help, guys. We could have jumped him. <laughs> scared me. <laughs> Can you read me? We're coming out of the old North Outward Station. There's no time to explain. All right, there we go. Bro, there's so many. Oh, the no fact way. that there's like maybe 30 of them, and there's only three of us, and we're still winning, is saying something. Okay, these guns are not the most powerful. Um, I'm sorry. Okay, yeah, we gotta get out of here. I'm <laughs> like one hit. Up here, hurry! Okay, hopefully there's no more. Where do I go? Where do I go? Where do I go? Oh! What? Where did they even come from? Am I gonna have to? Wait, a lot. Back up! Back up! Okay, cool. Come on. Go, go, go. No, 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 not a not a perfect job, but, but we, we we did what we had to. So then the guy says, "Well, you better keep <sighs> okay. in mind too, because now I gotta catch the goddamn thing." <laughs> Cheers. Mm. Hopefully, you guys Good appreciate job. this one, and well you done. guys get a yeah. two-in-one episode. Well, well you did last episode too, but yeah. you you get what I mean. Yeah. Well, the map proves it. Whose place is this? <laughs> Jake didn't screw around in the East Indies for six months. He sailed straight through and headed to Arabia. Right. Here's where it gets interesting. You see this, Mark? This is Double John seven. D's signature. Who the hell's John D? John D? One of Queen Elizabeth's closest advisors. Everybody knows that. Yeah, yeah, he was a great mathematician and navigator. Hey, way ahead of his time. He's probably the one who invented that. Seriously into the occult. I mean, like a really creepy dog. Yeah, see, right? he signed all his letters to the Queen with this symbol, meaning he was her eyes. The original 007, you see, look, 007. Not really that relevant. So, it was John D. who sent Drake to Arabia? Yeah, it looks that way. D. and Elizabeth. And Walsingham. And Great, but what Chloe for? so fine. Well, that's the million dollar question, isn't it? <clears throat> this is where T. E. Lawrence comes in. See, before Lawrence became Lawrence of Arabia... Great film. He was an archaeologist. And even when he was just a kid, he was obsessed with history. Everything to do with knights and crusades. He traveled all over, documenting every Crusader site he could find. It, it's all in here. All right, you lost me completely, kid. What the hell has this got to do with Drake? I'm getting to that. See, after the war, Lawrence said that if he were ever to go back to Arabia, it would be to search for this place he called the Atlantis of the Sands. Now, the legend crops up over and over again under different names. Ubar, Aram of the Pillars, the City of Brass. But the story is always the same. See, that's something I like about these oh, games. Like, even though the cutscenes can be a little lengthy, they're God interesting at least. Swallowed forever in the sands of the Rubalkali Desert. Right here. <laughs> I like the immeasurable wealth part, anyway. And you think this is what Elizabeth and Dee sent Drake after? Oh, yeah. But more importantly, it's what Marlowe is after. So, wait. If Drake was on a mission from the Bro, queen to find this like... place... Wild kids secrecy. playing outside. I mean, it looks like he went to a lot of trouble to hide whatever he found, even from Her Majesty. Okay, okay. I don't know. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. What was that? No, hang on a second. Because if you recall the last yeah, time sorry we if went you guys halfway hear that, around though. the world searching for a lost city, things got more than a little dicey. Yeah, but this time we have the upper hand. I mean, look, Drake only had half. If you don't know what she's talking about, we're talking about the last half. game. We have both, and Marlowe has nothing. Small <clears throat> The Rubalkali Desert, 600 miles across. 
The Bedouin go around the damn thing. And even That'll if we be... knew where it was, <laughs> okay. if we don't, we would die trying to find Just, it. Just hold on. You see these symbols here? Yeah. Looks like Sabian's script. script. Right. Look, the Crusaders were searching for the same lost city a thousand years ago. But out of all the sites Lawrence documented, only two are marked with these symbols. One in Syria, the other in France. Oh. No, you two are going to Syria. We're heading to France. Look, we track down these clues. Oh, okay, we find so we're splitting up and going to two I'm different sure places Why around the globe. How are we going to get across 600 miles of impossible wasteland? That boxing uh, stuff in the background. In the middle of the desert. So technically, it'd be about 300 miles. Oh. Look, I don't know. We'll figure it out. You know what the real we question is, man? Where is um, exactly. Elena? What do you say? I actually don't know where she is in this what game. What the hell? Let's do it. <laughs> Yeah, that's crazy. She really hasn't shown up yet. I remember her being in this game. I don't know if it's like in the middle of the game or half. I mean, like at the end. I don't know. But I know she's in definitely the line, in the game. Don't. Looks like we're going the rest of the way on foot. Where did we find this car? <laughs> what? Leave it to you to find a friggin' jungle in the middle of France. <laughs> this looks like the well, first game now. Head in the right direction. Chateau should be this way. Not too far. <sighs> okay. Yeah. Not too far. <laughs> With you, I never right. know if that means a quarter mile or twenty. That is a good place to end this one, man. If you enjoyed it, feel free to drop a like, share, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I'm in A4, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.